Welcome back, everyone. I am your host, Austin Haynes. Um, I haven't really thought about naming the channel anything. So, as of now, the channel is named Austin Haynes. Um, and I did that because I was trying to change... I had my YouTube set up through my um, email account. And when uh, I changed the channel before, because I was going to change it to uh, Extra Mile Trucking, which I thought was pretty neat. But then it changed my email account, so then all my emails sent out as Extra Mile Trucking. So I changed it back to my name. So, alright you guys, as you can see, I'm in a hotel room. Um, kind of different. You guys have never seen me in a hotel because normally I'm living out of the back of a pickup truck. But uh, I am in Little Rock, Arkansas. And I actually uh, quit hot shot trucking. So I got hooked up with uh, Maverick Transportation. You guys have probably seen them. They got the, uh, the crisp, dark maroon Cascadias that haul flatbeds. Um, they also have some low boys with Conestogas and stuff on them uh, that haul glass and everything like that. So I'm sure you guys have seen them. Look out for them because I'm going to be in one. So uh, I put in an application with them a few weeks back. Um, things with Hotshot were just kind of going downhill for me. Things weren't working out the way I was wanting them to. So I put in some applications at a couple places and Maverick got back to me uh, really quickly. <coughs> and oh, look at that. Got my little Maverick ID badge. Whoop, whoop. Maverick. So I am in uh, Little Rock, Arkansas doing uh, training and orientation. I'll be down here for about two weeks. I got hired on as an experienced driver, but I still have to go through uh, like four days of orientation and then uh, seven days of flatbed securement. It's all paid, of course. They're giving me uh, a thousand bucks a week to be down here, which is pretty neat. And then I'll be home for Thanksgiving. So today is Tuesday the 13th right now. I got down here uh, Saturday night and they're putting me up in a hotel room. They're paying for my breakfast and lunch. Pretty good gig. Um, but yeah, I quit hotshot trucking um, and moving up to a semi. It's something I've been wanting to do for a while. A lot of you guys were commenting on my videos asking why I do things a certain way. Well, I did it because that was all part of my master plan. So, and it's all coming together really nicely. I uh, just want to say thanks for all the support you guys have given me. Um, and you probably won't see a video uh, until next Thursday. I'll do a video of my truck when I get it and go over everything. Pretty exciting. I believe with me coming in as an experienced driver, I think they said we might be getting the brand new 2019 Freightliner Cascadias. So if I go to get a brand spanking new 2019, that's going to be pretty sick. Much, much deserved, I feel like. <laughs> um, but yeah, man, that's, that's about it. Um, they're going to pay. I'll do a little breakdown. So with me being experienced, they're going to start me with 56 cents a mile. All miles paid. I pay zero maintenance I don't pay for anything um, and so 56 cents a mile I'll probably do a little less miles than I do now if I hang around probably 2600 um, so good paycheck for me and then also okay I'll get uh, raises after my experience goes up every six months and they are just gonna give me a uh, PFP pay pay for performance so pretty much, uh, don't wreck your truck, be on time. Pretty simple stuff. They said uh, like 95% of their drivers get paid for performance. And it can go all the way. They're going to start me off with two cents pay for performance. And then every quarter it can go up or down, whether you, how your driving is. But you can go up to six cents pay for performance. So I could be uh, up at 62 cents a mile doing, uh, doing flatbed hauling. And they will uh, get me home every weekend is what I put down. So I'm in regional regional. Midwest division uh, I leave in Missouri so I'll be all over regional Midwest um, and I put out five days out two days home and they said with my area that it shouldn't be a problem so I'll get to spend more time at home with the wife and kids so for all you dirty ass perverts out there saying that you're gonna go keep my wife company and all these other ignorance responses that you guys keep posting on my videos knock it off dude it's not funny um, you guys aren't cute putting it it's just, it's frustrating, it's annoying, it's immature. I mean, I'm 22 years old and I'm calling you guys immature now. Uh, you see a problem with that? So let's knock it off, um, but it'll be really nice to be home um, every weekend almost. Granted, some weekends I'll have to stay out, but they said maybe just two or three times a year. So um, training is really strict, man. It's, it's no joke down here, but uh, 
I can't get any footage, no phones, absolutely no phones. I was going to hope to get some footage of the load securement bays and everything, but they got me uh, at the hotel here because the other place, uh, they have a hotel on campus, but they got like a big headquarters there. Um, it was a little, it was full or something, but whatever. The group I'm in, they're over here. My roommate's out right now, so I got the whole room to myself. Uh, but that's about it. Um, if you guys seen when I was doing my little intro, I have a a bed or a uh, a pillow on the or a, a towel I have a towel on the bed because it's got white sheets like beautiful white sheets and I was eating some spaghetti that I packed and I didn't want to get a uh, get any spaghetti sauce on the on the on the crisp white sheets so I laid down a towel and ate over that and the first day uh, I ate a peanut butter and jelly sandwich and I spilled a little bit of a jelly on the sheet and I tried to wipe it up real quick and it just smeared, so I got like a purple stain on it. <laughs> but uh, what can you do? Maybe I'll leave a tip for the the hotel people. I don't know what they're called. The people that do the rooms, not stewardesses. Um, leave me a comment. I don't know what they're called. Oh, uh, housekeepers. Are they called housekeepers? They probably are. But yeah, so. Uh, I'll give you guys a uh, update when I get my truck, so don't go asking me a whole lot of questions because I don't know a whole lot. I just know what orientation was like because I've been here for four days. Um, but I will uh, keep you guys posted as uh, as we join the journey on Maverick. So, but they, oh, also they'll be paying me a 401k matching 401k up to 50%. So any other Maverick drivers that are out there watching my video, if I say something incorrect, don't bash me too hard, because these are all the facts that I've learned in four days. <laughs> um, but yeah, and then they also have pretty uh, pretty kick-ass benefits too. So it was like, for the entire family, it's gonna be like 103 uh, a week. So, it's, I mean, it's kinda high. I had union benefits before, so it's a little bit higher than that, but it's really not that bad when you compare them to some people's. So 103 a week, and it's really, really good benefits, honestly. So, um, but man, that's it. Uh, leave me a shout out where you guys are watching from. Uh, say if you guys are near any Maverick terminals, there's several out there. Or uh, just check in in the comments. I'll try to respond because every night I'll be in the hotel doing nothing but watching my YouTube feed grow. So, um, 10,000 subscribers. Let's get there. Peace out, guys. All right, quick update um, that I just forgot. Maverick is also giving me a $5,000 sign-on bonus. So that was one of the deciding factors as along with uh, all the other great things that Maverick does. But yeah, they're paying me $5,000. And some people are like, well, yeah, that's gonna be like over a year or two. No, no bitch, it ain't. They're paying me five grand and it's gonna pay out within four or five months. I'm not sure. You get $1,000 when you drop your first load and then you get $1,000 a month for the remaining months. So I don't know if they'll, my first month, I don't know if it'll be $2,000 and then over the next three months, it'll be 1,000, which would be four months total. Or if when I drop my first load, I'll get 1,000 and then I'll wait the next month and then it'll be five months total. You guys get what I'm saying? But uh, yeah, either way, five grand sign on bonus. All right, 